Okay, guys, so it's so much going on with this situation. So if you're not sure what exactly is going on here, Molly, which is Corey's alleged baby's mother, is claiming that Corey is not wanting to take the DNA test for her two-year-old son. Now, Molly and Carmen decided to go live on Instagram with all T all shade to speak on the situation. Like, you know, a lot of people be like the the page. Can you hear me? Mm-hmm. Okay, hold on. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Okay. I can hear you. All right, so I'm gonna say this. Let's get the Y'all, I feel like y'all can really get along. So we have before. We have before plenty of time. Okay, this is my only thing. And once I said this, I'm not gonna keep addressing the situation due to the fact that it has been multiple private conversations before this even came to social media. You feel me? So due to the fact that at some point we was communicating and at some point because we dealt with the same guy you feel me right so when it came to this this is where i got lost and this is why i don't speak on the situation only is because i was told one thing but in reality it was done a different thing you feel me so, so, for example, so we on the same we on the same so, so for example like at some point you know me and molly was communicating and she was telling me about Oh yeah, Corey will never change because he this, he that, he would do this, he would do that. Da, da, da. You telling me how Corey is because you don't deal with him. Okay, cool. But then you turn around and you texting him about, oh, let's link up or where can I meet you? Or can I do that? Let me finish. So with that being said, I get confused because I even text her about it. I said, I said, so what's up, Molly? You got me confused because you just text me. A week ago, we was talking about, you know, you be the main one telling me, oh, Corey will never change, or Corey will never do this, da -da, because he's still going to be a hoe, da -da, da -da. and then I even told her, I said, but then you turn around, and you texting him, like, oh, I'm about the gas station, where you want to meet at? Mind you, I'm seeing the messages, and I'm reading. So that's when I told her, I said, I don't like when people is, like, lying to me and playing games, because, okay. you know, as a woman, I feel like... I won't really, if you know for a fact this dude is such a hoe and this, such a hoe and this and the third, you wouldn't want your man be texting another dude. And I and I totally and you respect, right about that. You let right me about finish. That. Let me finish. And I okay, totally I'm respect, and I'm I totally respect I the say. fact that she was the first love, you know, like whatever. I totally respect that. I never came to her like in no wrong way as me saying like, bitch, you can love him. I never did it. I never even called this girl out of her name on social media at all. So with that being said, like when stuff like this, you know, keep coming to me. Yes, you did, Carmen. Yes, you did. Yes, after you like did this. it. After you like did this. it. I never brought you up to social media Don't at all. Like I never even discussed. I never even exposed messages. I ain't brought I never, you up to social media either. Let me finish. Every time it was a situation between you and him, Carmen comes up. Carmen comes up. Carmen comes up. Karmic comes up, so that's the only thing that I feel like I understand. We are, you like you and we are one. I totally understand that. You feel me? But at the same time, it's like you know what was behind the doors. You know what was in private. You know the conversation me and you done had, and you know the conversation you and him had, and you know the the the, the time we confronted each other, all uh, three of us. You feel me? So when it comes to the social media thing, I don't like being called out of my name, especially when I, I don't speak about you. I don't even throw shots at you and if, if if for example if Corey says something about in my ex my ex he's not and, this, and I, this is not me really taking Corey's side or anything but this had happened in other cases molly is not Corey's only ex before i got with Corey, molly wasn't the ex it was another girl that that's the ex that that's i knew that's what me and Corey that's was together that's where she came in the picture and that's what i'm real i was like Oh, this is Corey, one of X, you feel me? So I'm like, okay, cool. And then since then, it's been a situation every time, every time, every time. And the only reason I never speak on it is because when I do speak on it, people get on me and say, oh, your man this, your man that. But it's like, all I wanted to do is just clear my name and leave it out of here, you feel me? Because I don't talk to him about it. But it's only so much I can do. I can just drag this man and put a gun in his head and hey, take the DNA test. It's only so much I can do. Like you told me the message, well, has a wife, you should, you know, demand him take a DNA test. You don't know what I've done, said already, because this is not the first time. This has been going on for so long. So, yes, I've done had the conversation multiple times. But when it comes to me, leave me out of it. 
for example, I'm not trying to copy your hair. I don't even know you have this fucking color. I don't watch you. People don't send me your pictures. You are blocked on all my social media. I don't know what kind of hairstyle you have. And this is not the first time, you know, they mommy say fun about, oh, she's trying to copy me. She did it because I did it first. But, like, no. I'm, I'm not. Saying, look, I, mean, I don't, I don't most... send for you. I don't send for you. People send stuff about you. To but, but that's my thing, though. So just because people send you stuff, that doesn't mean you have to address it and drag me. People send me stuff about you all the time with me personally, like, Okay, but you're not about shit I know for a fact she's not talking about me all the fucking time. Because if you're right. talking about me all the time, this means, okay, you miserable to be talking about me. You feel me? So her comment, you say, like, I'm a transgender. She's copying everything I do. She's obsessed and this and that. That kind of boils me down to the point that now I don't care if the truth <laughs> is the truth. Now, at this point, I don't care to find out the truth. Because you feel honestly. But I guess that... Okay, I need to talk too, though. I need to talk too, cause I let her talk for a long ass time. I need to talk too. So this, okay. this, this is my thing. Yeah, hear, hear me? Uh -huh. Yeah, this this uh -huh. my thing. This my thing right here. See, you saying like back and forth shit and about the social media shit. Okay. See, Carmen, I always came to you calm, cool, and collected. Mm -hmm. I have never came at you strong. I don't know. I'm gonna did. fight you shit. I never did that. We was always chill, okay? And about that little birthday situation, talking about, well, we always had middle. He always made it seem like you was the problem, and he was showing me y'all messages saying that you be star shit, and that you know my number by heart, and all type of shit, like, and then, like, okay, back to the birthday situation, by me meeting up with him. He had already told me he was coming. We had already made an agreement that we were going to meet each other down there. That's this okay. You say you don't know shit, some shit you don't know. Okay, that's fine. I can understand it, but it's a whole bunch of shit he told me about you. So right, I'm, just okay. and then let's go back to. I knew him longer than you, though. I knew him longer than you, way, way longer than you. So why would I believe somebody who with somebody else and I'm dealing with the same person? Why would I believe that person? Like how you lied and told me that this man had herpes on the phone. You you lied about a lot of shit too. So don't even do that. Don't even make it seem like Wait, I'm what? fine with you. Yeah, you told me that this man had herpes. You no, I did not. That was yes, no. you did. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, wait. You did. Yes, Let you me did. talk if you're gonna don't make that because they're I gonna drag finish. this when I never I said that. Finish. No, I I, let you okay, finish. no, but don't I make allegations like that because I, I never said that about court. And that's on my son. So let's not lie to me here. You Let's not lie. You lie so because you the one who called me and you, you told me that he so gave you something and, and that's why you called me. Let's let's come he on, gave let's you get it together. Too. Let's get it together. He gave here. you something. Let's gave not you go chlamydia. over here because I'm still he here. Gave you so I need you over here. He gave you chlamydia. He what? gave you chlamydia and he gave me the same shit. So just stop. And then you try. You said why everybody said he got a little wee wee. Why everybody said he got herpes. You told me that. So I can stop talking to you. Why are you a liar? No, you just not keep talking. Keep talking. Keep talking. Keep talking. Yeah. Keep talking. yeah. No, no, no. Let her finish. Let her finish. Yeah. So, no, I need to get this shit that y'all got going on. Like how you said, you don't got nothing to do with it. You do not. But he do. Like how you say you can't force him to take no DNA case. You right, you don't. And and then you know what? I'm going to admit. Sometimes I do be wrong for going off on you and shit like that. I do be wrong. I'm going to admit. And you are right. Everything Bro. ain't got nothing to do with you at all. It got you everything see. to do with him. And I've been talking to him a long time ago. You said this right. DNA test, long, long time ago, before I even had him and Carmen, you know this too. I've been asking to do the DNA test. Ben. I think Corey took her phone. But me in very disrespectful right now. Huh? And he's been very disrespectful. Disrespectful to you. He always like that. He but always you, like that. He's showing his true colors on live though. That's what that's fine. And I want everybody to see this. I want everybody to see this. And you see how you see how even though me and Carmen don't like each other, we can sit down and try and figure out something, right? But, but Corey can't. Corey, Corey be lying problem. to her. He's the problem, and I see that right now. Yes, Corey be lying to her because the and truth gonna come out and, and you know what i'm seeing that and i i don't care how nobody feel i'm being biased but it's the truth he's the problem and then he can get on live but she can't he can get on live but she can't yep that's she, some dumb ass shit that's dumb he gonna get her in a lot of mess she need to go ahead and leave him because that's, i'm sorry, but already me her and him we've been through so much shit together we've been through so much shit together this shit is wrong it is a mess now y'all see what the fuck i'm talking about I'm glad that this shit hit the fan. And then I've I been saying something. I've been saying, look, I cannot wait till all this shit come out because this shit right here is just too much. 
And y'all, when they that they relationship is perfect. I'm, I'm, I'm going to take back my little comment where I said I respect her because now I see it's her, it's him. It's not her, it's him. That's it's, why she be standing like, up to him because he be saying some of rude shit to her. Same way I said he be calling me insecure, dumb, and stupid. He said the same shit to her. Is she and we be- both love the nigga. We both love the nigga. Don't was- get me wrong, but she love him more. But did you see he t- he he to he me next up phone. He wanted to fight her. So at this point, it's a lot of stuff going on right now. And all I gotta say, I hope she gets away from him. And I'm not saying that because I'm busy, and blah blah blah. But I'm a woman. But she right, right. And I told her, if I'll talk. Then it's gonna a lot of the truth is coming out. And Carmen is a beautiful woman. But it's time to. And walk. I told her that plenty it's time. time walk away. I told her, I said, Carmen, I said, you too pretty to be dealing with all that bullshit. I will even show y'all my messages with this girl. I told her, I said, truth be told, I said, bitch, you got so so many people out here that love you. You need to start your own clothing line. You need to do something. I said, do you know how many people love you? Do you know how many people love you? You making more money than this nigga. And I just, I, I can't respect that because what I just witnessed on this live, it's like, Oh my gosh! Yeah, no, he is not abusing. He just verbally abusive. Now, he, I don't see him abusing her. He's verbally abusive. He it's is not. Really? He will literally drain your mental to the point where you asking yourself, "Why me? What is wrong with me?" I know because I went through that with him. He's talking about get off the live, but you've been on live. You're you're dissing a woman. No, let your woman take care of it. Even though it's you know his responsibility as far as the the DNA test go, he needs to take care of that. But at the same time, he, she's trying to talk it out with you. Whole thing, she's stressed out. And I, and See, we, I, me and Carmen, we always been like that. We always calmed our feelings down and was trying to talk each other in, talk to each other in the right way. And Carmen always was step between us, and he would tell me shit about her, and then he would tell her shit about me. So we could not be cool. Me and Carmen, look, like I said with that DNA test shit, I had to hit up Carmen for Corey to respond. Carmen called me 3 o'clock in the morning. I don't know how she found out I was pregnant by him or whatever the case may be. I don't know how she found out. She had to go through his phone or something. And she she called me. She woke me up. She said, Molly, are you really pregnant by him? I said, at that time, it's a 50-50 chance, right? I told her that. This man did the fucking most. He called me. Don't trust shit. She say, I got you. You straight. I'm going to take care of you. You Nobody ain't got to say nothing. Don't run chicken. to the internet. Side chicken, you need to learn your place. Let's. Girl, let's let's go off on that subject of a side chick because I guess some of y'all don't know her story. They they had a baby before, blah 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 blah. They ain't got nothing to do with the situation. The situation is if he's not the daddy, then just take a DNA test to clarify for both of them. But at the same time, Carmen was on here trying to make peace and amends with this girl, and he took the phone. But you can go on live and talk about this, and you can talk about that. No, you need to step up as a man. But you on the internet showing off your cars and your luxuries and stuff. No, you step up and be a man. Now y'all really see that fucked up side of him. Y'all see now. And I don't care how nobody feels like me or the situation. They say go, uh, who, I guess I mean, who cares though? So it's a child involved in this situation. It's not just two girls being messy. And you this- know what? I ain't even mad at Carmen. I ain't even mad at Carmen. Like that little shit right there, that just, that just really, like I, I'm cool. I ain't even got shit else to say bad about her. Like that shit straight with me because she always woman enough to talk to me. She was always woman enough to talk to me, and I was always woman enough to talk to her. That's one thing I can say that we got in common. That's one thing I can say. I don't have nothing bad to say about Carmen. Like like I said, that little conversation that we just had, we straight. You feel me? But now y'all see who the problem is. It's fucking Corey. It's Corey. But he it's should, fucking Corey. He has anger problems. <laughs> he do. He want everything to go his way. We cannot <laughs> add Carmen back when her dog is Cause I bet you they arguing right now. He probably done broke up phone and more shit. He do shit like that. Like I said, I'm trying to be the peacemaker in this situation. Carmen was fine. Y'all was fine. Y'all was getting along, you know, saying how y'all felt about the situation. But he came in the room, I guess, mad. I don't know. But she's stepping up. But I feel like it's it's stressing her out because I saw her Instagram story because it's like, I keep trying to cover for him and cover for him and cover for him. But baby, it's time to let go. Yes, because I ain't gonna lie, like, me and Carmen, we the type where we ride or dies, and we gonna ride till the wheels fall off. That's what kind. That's that's how we is. So I mean, I really can't. I can't fault her for that. I can't fault fault her for that because I know how that feels. I have been through the same shit with the same man. But that that I, it's like I felt that I'm very spiritual. It's when he was came in there, I, I, I felt it too. I said that's why I said, "And fuck you." 
it's something. I grew up in the church, baby. I'm spiritual. That did not feel right. I felt that. And it's like, it's, it's some anger and it's like a stronghold. He mad because this shit getting out here. He mad, And then not once did Carmen say that he ain't his. Not once did she say that. She never said so that. I'm taking a side. First of, first of all, I'm not taking no side. But when it's a kid involved, all I said, the child may not be his. The child may. If the child is his, the child is not, then move on. And move on. No, ain't nobody destroying their lives, baby. Corey destroyed it. Corey destroyed it. Carmen ain't had no, I ain't had no baby by Carmen. Corey did. I had a baby by Corey. I didn't have no baby by Carmen. So really like, y'all, please. So For as real. you guys can see there, Corey was not having it. He snatched the phone out of Carmen's hand and pressed in on that Instagram live. So as always, I want to know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. Are you guys believing Molly or Corey? I want to know down in the comment section below.